Oh, uh, you know, I started playing golf about a decade ago. Um, it, it, it's kind of a funny story, but it's also kind of a, uh, uh, I guess it's kind of cliche. The biography of Tiger Woods was on TV. I kind of got transfixed, went out and bought my first set of clubs uh, from a pawn shop. There were 50 bucks set of Northwestern muscle bags. Uh, anyway, got into the game, played my first round of golf uh, on my 14th birthday. So it's been almost 10 years now, and uh, you know, I've enjoyed every minute of it. it, it it's been a real good journey so far, and I hope to keep playing. It's one of those games you can play for your entire life. Uh, you know, so it's just, uh, it's an ongoing process. For Blake Miley, golf is more than a game. He wants to make a career of it. With expert advice and the help of sponsors, he's decided to turn pro. The thing I really enjoy working with someone like Blake is that, you know, you give them some little things to work on and they work on it very hard. Um, here every day, you know, hitting balls, pounding balls, you know, you know, like the old saying is the game is in the dirt. So if you don't spend the time on the range, you can't make it out there. Uh, you can have a ton of talent, but if you don't work on it, you have a ton of talent. Basically what we've done is uh, we initially just took a look at the swing, where he's at, uh, some of the issues or concerns that he had. Um, he has a very good golf swing. I mean, he's a very good player. So with someone like that, you're just fine tuning what they're, what they're doing so that uh, they have something to work on, something to really focus on to uh, make their game or get their game to uh, the highest level they can. What we would call tweaking their swing. Uh, we're not going to do an overhaul on someone that has, you know, 99% of what he's doing is a good, solid golf swing. Good to kind of have a mentor like that who's, who's been out on the tour already. And uh... That was definitely a, a plus. Um, Steve's been out there. He's done it before. He knows what it's like. He knows what the life's like, and it's it's like you said, it's a good mentor. It's somebody that can kind of show me the ropes. I played for almost four years trying to make it on the on the big stage myself. Um, really, it's just the dedication you have, um, the commitment to say this is going to be my job. Um, it's something that I'm going to plan out and work on. The thing I really enjoy working with someone like Blake is that you know you give them some little things to work on, and they work on it very hard. I'm all about hard work and you know that's the way we, you know, I was raised no matter what you do make sure you're you know you tr strive to be the best at it and give it 110 uh, percent especially if it's something you love and you have a passion for and you can't help but to put the time and the energy into it and that's how it is with me in golf um, you know I love to practice I love to work hard and um, you know I, I feel like if I'm not out here practicing that I don't deserve uh, the rewards and as a certified fitness trainer he's already proven he's no stranger to hard work Golf has gone, has really evolved. I mean, golf used to be, you know, if you didn't play any other sports, you played golf. Now you have athletes playing golf, and you have to, you know, be in good shape, and you have to be, you know, committed to beyond just playing golf. Golf, uh, you have to be committed to being in, in good condition, being, you know, able to uh, under stress play, all those things. So it's more than just the mental and the, the you know, your general golf swing, you have to be committed to the whole whole process. Skill and concentration are critical for a successful golf career, but so too is money and dedicated sponsors willing to support a promising athlete committed to the game. You know, you can be the best player in the world, but if you don't have the backing, you're not going to make it. And that's one of the problems about golf. It is such a tough sport to get into professionally because of the expenses. Uh, so I'm looking for something that, you know, uh, basically the way I can stay out there and play great golf and uh, have my chance, my shot out there. Well, you have a variety of expenses. You have entry fees. You have um, hotels and food and lodging and, and um, you know, gas and all those things. So just the travel is probably the biggest part of it. Um, and having, you know, sponsorships where you don't have to worry about a lot of that takes the pressure off of, of that stuff and they can focus on the golf. Anything that needs to be done for a sponsor, um, I'm all about hard work and I'm all about paying back the people that, that helped me out. Um, anything that you know a sponsor would need as far as maybe playing in a golf tournament, making an appearance somewhere, doing this or that, it's, it's really not a problem and I'm all for it. If someone's going to put some money into someone, they want to know that they're dedicated to what they're doing. They're going to put the time in. They're going to spend and put the effort into it. I think the next part of it is, is like any marketing thing, 
you want to be able to have something that's marketable and uh, you know um, he's not my type of guy but he's a good looking guy and uh, um, <laughs> but uh, but um, great personality you know easy to talk to easy to get along with you know all those things all those qualities um, make someone marketable I, I think the the other piece of it is, is that being in the personal training uh, end of the business he's able to communicate and talk to people and and um, express himself and you know have a good uh, you know interaction with people I think someone like Blake with uh, his attitude and what he brings to the table um, would be phenomenal out there I think he's very marketable um, and he's the type of guy that you would would want to put a, a logo on him and say he's part of the team to learn more about sponsorship and sports marketing opportunities with Blake Miley, go to BlakeMiley.com.